the question for me is, why? Why would George Bush's government or his intelligence agencies want to commit this enormous crime, which if discovered, would see them all in the electric chair and the entire democratic system of the United States destroyed? Why? So they could invade Iraq. They could have invaded Iraq by sending out some envelopes full of white powder and found that as a casus belly. Why do you think, Walter, they would do this? The sights were set, of course, first of all, on Afghanistan. Uh, because of the, um, uh, well, first of all, because the Taliban had been far too successful in eliminating or at least reducing the opium uh, trade. But, but why would you need to do all of that to justify invading Afghanistan? Well, they, they in the need United a cover. Well, no, they don't need a cover. They don't need a cover in Venezuela. They didn't need a cover to uh, attack the Iranian uh, general. Why would they need such a dramatic cover? Uh, to do something as, frankly, mundane to the American public as flying over and attacking Afghanistan. The reason is that uh, they wanted an international coalition to uh, participate in the invasion of Afghanistan, and they succeeded on the basis of the emotional reaction to 9-11. But why did they need that uh, international coalition? Well, <laughs> they didn't have it in Iraq, but they went ahead anyway. Yeah. Um, well, obviously in Afghanistan, um, it was very convenient for them to, as I said, use the emotional pull of 9-11 and to get this international coalition to invade. Well, I'm asking you why they needed an international coalition. Well, <laughs> Afghanistan was a Stone Age country with a Stone Age military uh, that the United States could obliterate uh, very easily from the sky. Well, as I said, they needed some kind of moral justification. Why? They, don't, they didn't have a moral justification for the Vietnam War. 